Hello. <coughs> Hello. I am Declan Gill of the Solaris Society of Opinions, the one place on earth all relevant opinions matter. It is fantastic to see all of you lovely people here today. Okay, so the Six Nations is over and done with for this year, and we can take a few things away from this to actually look to the future of the magnificent sport known as rugby, a dog's game played by gentlemen. So, first things first, I said weeks ago that I would give weekly reports on how Ireland were doing. I am so very sorry, I never got around to that. After losing to England in our opening game, we beat Scotland, we beat Italy, we beat France, but today we were hammered by Wales. It's not even that Wales won, it's that Ireland lost, from what I heard. 22-7 the final score, I believe. Congratulations Warren Gatland on your final game in charge. Whoever your replacement is has massive shoes to fill. Andy Farrell will be replacing Joe Schmidt. You also have massive shoes to fill, Andy. Whatever way you look at it. <clears throat> but given the air that's in it and the amount of talent at our disposal, obviously, yes, try out new faces for this Six Nations. See who is going to be in the overall squad to travel for the World Cup this year. It wasn't the year to try and win the Six Nations, the Grand Slam or the Triple Crown. Give that to Wales. <laughs> okay, so my overall point for this is Ireland had to make sure that their overall best players are well and truly rested for the World Cup. Because I am a firm believer that with the, the amount of talent at our disposal the future is very bright for Irish rugby, as was proved with the under 20s winning the under 20s Grand Slam. And now I want to speak to the head of the French rugby team, Jacques Brunel. Choisset Daniel Brennan pour l'équipement senior maintenant. I don't know if my French is any good. If it isn't, I apologise if I offend any French people. Ultimately, I'm saying to Jacques Brunel directly, bring Daniel Brennan up to the senior team now, as with many other faces, because the faces you have right now in that team are not doing shit for you. And yes, they finished fourth in the Six Nations, but for the amount of talent that's supposed to be at France's disposal, that is a disaster! Lastly, I want to speak to Scotland's comeback today. Where did that come from? Look, they were well and truly beaten at one point and they came back for a 38, 38 draw! What? Where did that come from? Where has this Scotland team been? I'm a big fan of Scottish rugby. Scottish people in general, they are some of the greatest crack on the planet. And now, I'm gonna just say, you are my favorite Scottish player, David Denton. We have a lot to look forward to in the future of rugby. But particularly with the Six Nations next year, I've told Jacques Brunel if he's still there for the Six Nations, what has to happen. And furthermore, the future for Irish rugby is very bright. I've been Declan Gill signing off. Subscribe to the channel, like this video, share it with a friend, click the bell so you never miss another notification. I'll speak to you next time. Bye!